the house of hook house divided twin 40s it's time to hunt the front at why not we are green all eyes on the front field works their way off of turn number two and just like they started side by side up the racetrack goes jeremy shaw see if he can get a run peyton freeman gonna leave lap one Comes Shaw got the outside momentum. He'll pull even, pull ahead by a nose in turn three. On the bottom comes Freeman. Motor in back. Jeremy Shaw leads lap number two. Shaw by point zero eight one to the race lead. They are still door to door, two by two by two, all the way through this field here at Why Not. That time Freeman. Leads again, Jeremy Shaw led the second lap. Freeman goes and leads the third. Oh, up the racetrack, hang on to it, Jeremy. Yeah, Jeremy Shaw took, took a little bit too much on that one. He's gathered it back though. He's about three car lanes now. But he'll start chipping away again. Kind of a separation between the front five. They will work lap number five, Peyton Freeman, Jeremy Shaw, Josh Putnam, Trey Mills, Kenny Collins, Dylan Tidmore, Will Harrington, Neil Baggett, Brendan Smith, and Joseph Joyner, your top ten. They're two and three wide. There's your three wide battle. That is for the eighth, ninth, and tenth position. Is Joyner looking underneath the Brendan Smith for ninth? Neil Baggett's right there on the outside. Now got a battle for second. Trey Mills putting pressure on Jeremy Shaw. Shaw's moved from the top to the bottom. That's going to open the outside lane for Josh Putnam. Trey Mills trying to find a way around Jeremy Shaw. They battle in turn one. Here comes Putnam outside of Mills. Move Putnam into the third spot. See if Mills stays glued to the bottom where he's been strong all weekend or if he tries to take a peek around the outside. Got a feeling that the 14 is a little bit faster than the one. They're three wide for second in turn two. Here comes Trey Mills. He's got the inside, but putting him on the outside. They clear Shaw. Shaw not going away, though. He'll slide back to the outside. He did not like the bottom. Ran a couple laps there. Got past. Lost two spots. Now he goes back to the outside where Trey Mills is second. Works the bottom. Josh Putnam's on the outside in front of Jeremy Shaw. Your leader, Peyton Freeman, completes lap number 10, 10 of 40. He works into the tail end of the field. They're in turn two. The battle still for second. The battle for fourth as Will Harrington moves in to the fifth position in front of Kenny Collins, and he'll go to work on Jeremy Shaw. Two and three group racing all over this racetrack, Chris, just like you said it would be earlier on in the evening. Can Trey Mills let lap traffic slow Peyton Freeman down just enough to get to him? The distance on the last completed lap, lap 11, was 1.8 seconds. A complete lap number 12, it's 1.4. So he gained four tenths to Trey Mills with the help of lap traffic. But you know, if uh, Peyton Freeman realizes he's got a lead, he may just take it easy navigating this lap traffic. There's Will Harrington battling with Jeremy Shaw. That battle will be for fourth. Underneath of Shaw goes Harrington. Harrington's trying to find some momentum around. Kenny Collins now goes to the outside, see what he can do as these guys go side by side, move Will Harrington into the fourth position. He'll get around Jeremy Shaw in turn four. I'm not sure if you can take it easy here at the house of Hook. Uh, Trey Mills already starting to close that gap between him and the one car. It's now nine tenths of a second. He went from 1.8 to 1.4 to nine tenths of a second. Did the young man Trey Mills. Putnam still using that middle to the outside groove. Definitely lap traffic coming into play here. It's kind of slowed the pace down on the front uh, for the F1. The 14 doing what he's got to do. He's just uh, following uh, right behind the F1, closing in each lap a little bit closer. Peyton Freeman's had a, uh, I guess, a dismal start by his standards to this season. He definitely wants a win here. Trey Mills has never won a race in super late model competition. He wants to win here. Both these drivers, uh, when they, as they work lap traffic, uh, definitely have all the motivation in the world to get this win. Keep your eyes on the top two. It's down to eight tenths of a second on lap 17. They complete lap 18, and he actually gained a, set, a tenth of a second, did Peyton Freeman, so he was able to extend it back to a nine tenths advantage. Now Freeman goes to the top to work the lap traffic, keep Mills on the bottom. 
Third is Josh Putnam. Will Harrington on the outside has worked his way into fourth. Your top two, here we go. He opened the door for him off of turn two using the outside. Did Peyton Freeman trying to get around the lap traffic. Mills shoots underneath. Is Trey Mills going to lead it? He will. He leads lap 20. Lap number 20 to Trey Mills. Now Freeman on the outside. He goes back around. They are door to door for the race lead down the back straightaway. Freeman on the outside. Mills on the bottom. Mills is held up by the lap traffic, and that's what Freeman's counting on. Give Freeman the lead on lap 21. So three, four lead changes already amongst three different drivers here at the halfway mark of this 40 lap feature event. Not 50, 40 laps and they are side by side for the race lead with a gaggle of race cars and slower traffic in front of them. It's a game of uh, chess, not checkers here. Peyton Freeman's got to race the, the cars in front of them. Now Trey Mills moves kind of up to the middle of the racetrack. See if he finds anything there. Oh, man, down in front of him. Now there's two lap cars in front of your race leader, Peyton Freeman. Freeman, you know, you have the disadvantage if you're the leader as we've got a car slowing off the top of turn four. We'll see if he can get clear. It's uh, Jason Garver. He will. We stay clean and green. You have the disadvantage if you're the leader working through lap traffic. The guy in second can kind of see where you're going to go and see if he can find a faster line around. Right. Both these drivers, first and second, married on the bottom of the racetrack. They'll complete lap number 25. We have 15 laps remaining, and we've got a good one here at the House of Hook. Here comes Trey Mills. He'll use that inside. He gets he gets a lot of traction off the bottom of turn two, and he almost pulled even with Freeman. Well, that time by we have a lead change yet yeah. again. That could be a setup yep. for he learned something he on did. that one. He did. We could see that come back yep. again here tonight. Yep. Both these racers very talented, oh, very Freeman. smart. Freeman back to the top of the racetrack, and Train Mills will lead another lap. First yep. time anybody other than Peyton Freeman has led two laps in a row. Peyton Freeman on the outside. Trey Mills on the bottom. Mills gonna go up in front of Freeman and use the outside to try to get around Thrash, but that opened the door for Freeman that time by Mills by 0.62. Wow. Point zero six two. And Mills, he's uh, got the lead there, but Freeman not going to give it up. He's going to race it to the line. I think Freeman led that lap. Nope, it nope. was Mills by 0.17. Oh, wow. 0.17. Seven. <laughs> Unbelievable. Mills on the outside. Freeman had the lead by a nose off of turn two, but Trey pulled even. Now Freeman going to lead lap 30. Ten laps remaining. It's been all green flag laps. We have yet to see a Panama City Cycles caution, and I hope we don't have to see one. Yeah, that's right. I hope we don't. That's right. As we've got a good one here at the House of Hook, why not? Motorsports Park is living up to its name. The top two have raced very well in lap traffic as Freeman in the F1 and Trey Mills have traded the lead three times already between these two drivers. Don't look now. Here comes Josh Putnam. Yeah, Putnam uh, getting uh, taking the advantage that these cars have been at battling lap traffic. And I wondered if uh, Mills has, uh, ran, a, ran his tires out too much when he was trying to track down Freeman uh, earlier. We'll see but here. But here we are. Outside. Battle oh, for the lead again. He'll slide up the racetrack. They'll drag race down the front straightaway seven at the go. line with seven laps to go. It's Peyton Freeman. Here comes Josh Putnam. Yep. Putnam, you see that green spoiler starting to peek in. Now Trey Mills on the outside. And Harrington, uh, second and a half back, so Harrington's still in the hunt. Oh, they're side by side. Who led it? It was Trey Mills on lap 34. My goodness gracious. Oh, my point oh, goodness. Oh, uh, .058 oh, there. Oh, my goodness. My God. It's good. Unbelievable. It's good here at Why Not. They are side by side. 15-year-old <laughs> Trey Mills leads lap 35. Five laps to go. We've got a three-car race for the lead. Yeah. Josh Putnam is there. He'll put the nose right up to the rear corner of Peyton Freeman. Trey Mills working hard. I've seen him get faster. Mills on the outside as laps wind down. Just four laps to go. Stay green. Stay clean. And we're going to have a good one. Now Mills running hard. He has turned the wick up on the 14 car. He is aggressive with these lap cars as Freeman's gone to the outside. Now Mills gets clear. He's got two lap cars in Crane and Henderson between he and now second place, Josh Putnam. 
Oh, we've got a good one here. You got to wonder if he's looking up at that scoreboard or if he's just racing that race car. Yep. Two laps to go. The flagman, two sticks in the air. Oh, here comes Freeman. Does he have anything left? He clears the two lap cars. It'll be the white flag. This time by, who's going to go to sublimited? Victory Lane. We are one lap away from finding out if it's going to be for the first time in his career. Trey Mills. Grandparents are in the grandstands, and you <laughs> want to see some nervous folks. Down the back straight away. In the turn three and four. How about it? For the first time in his career, he'll pick up a super late model win. He's hunt the front and found it at Wild Not. Why not did <laughs> Trey Mills? What a race, Chris. Man, I